Ah, who's talking? <laughs> what is this? It seems you are my host. Do you know what happened? <laughs> no, I don't. This is crazy. This is crazy. I'm talking to my arm. Well, it's a new experience for me also. <laughs> but now is not the time to dwell. We have things to do. Why should I even trust you? I don't even know you. Or what you are. Well, you shouldn't. But I'm your only chance of getting out of here alive. Oh, yes. Yeah, so funny for you, isn't it? But I suppose I don't have any choice in the matter now. Please, point me in the right direction. And no funny business. As you wish. Best we move forward, then. <laughs> And I, I kind of pulled away because, you know, it was already in my head. And I thought maybe if he pulled it out, it would hurt. Take a little bit of my brain out with it, which I don't have much of to begin with. So, um, basically. Oh, no, I know. You killed me. There's a lot of uh, solar energy out here for my little flowery petals that keeps me going. I like to compare myself to Elon Musk, you see, because I like to use solar energy compared to all the other kinds, like crystal energy, which, you know, are very harmful for the environment. Look at these warplings here, you know, they, they tend to abuse the stuff and they are very...
Nothing Radio, and this is your host, Schooler Joe. Today we got a special episode. Activate the generator. With your electrical charge, it will restore the island's gravitational pull and shift those two islands back in place to give your little corporeal form a bridge. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. Haven't I been nothing but cordial and helpful so far? I don't understand why. I have my reasons. <laughs> I must be going crazy. This isn't real. I'm talking to my crystal arm! Come on now, ghost! <laughs> keep moving! I promise to keep you alive once all this is over! What's stopping me from just cutting you off with the next axe I find? We are linked! <laughs> Whether you like it or not, if you damage me, <laughs> you'll feel it too. with it which I don't have much of to begin with so um basically I, I ran away real far and I hid in a forest it's quite easy to hide in a forest when you're a flower you see the problem was he was also a flower so and all of them and so he could kind of see the same with the fact that I was in amongst my flower brethren and he came running in that forest he was angry at this point he really wanted his pedal back and you know, I was kind of hiding my Frodo in the first Lord of the Rings film underneath Crystal 
about the fact that he was living in my pocket this whole time. So he, his legs actually kind of uh, atrophied and withered away. And he actually didn't have legs whatsoever. So he just fell down on the floor in front of me, dropping the pedal on the ground. And by that point, the guy saw the pedal of my little friend. But I was able to hide behind a big piece of root that was just draping over the log, which I was...
tired of the taste of baguette. You have fulfilled your end of the bargain. Now it is time for me to obey my... Hmm, I wonder, how can I get to that tower over there? Why don't you try doing a bit of D.I.D.? <laughs> Didn't you mean to say D.I.Y.? No, I meant do it exactly as I tell you. Now, Bill, my dim-witted flesh bag, haven't you ever played Jenga before? What if I haven't? <laughs> you prepubescent orphan child of a man! I'm feeling a little 
Ah, uh, you, mate, with the fucking, uh, yeah, the crystal arm. Can you help me out? These bloody abyssal, uh, could you get them off me? No, I can't hold them off much longer. It seems like you could help this man. Sorry, we got you to respond to the plot,
lucky you. Thanks for helping me out, right? Yeah, I bloody owe you one. What are you doing here? How come you're the only other person I've seen? I would mistrust him if I was you. Hi, easy there, mate. You saved my life. I was spared the worst of the abyssal's attack by hiding in my radio hut. Don't listen to this babbling idiot. You only slow us down. Hey, yeah, they are uh, your arm, yeah, they, they little arm there. It has a little mouth on that guy, my dude. Yeah, you got a little guy on your arm, dude, my guy. You little, 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 little arm on your guy. I mean, you got a little guy on your arm, dude. Yes, I am aware of my arm. Yeah, well, I'll, um, I'll tell you what, my bud, my little guy. Why don't you help me, uh, help you? I'll help you out, my guy. It's, uh, yeah, it's uh, the least I can do for you fucking helping me out. It's like saving my life. Well, what did you have in mind? Well, just so happens that being in this tower and all, I got a little lay of the land, you see, my little guy. I can guide you to where you need to go. Anywhere. Anywhere you want to go. Another guide. Great. Great.